Hello, everyone, and welcome to live interactive English. I'm Mike, and I'm Karen. Today we are looking at part one of Harry Styles, Pops. Prince Harry. I'm so excited we get to talk about Harry Styles. And before we start doing that,、yes. I have to sing a song. Okay. But you know, this kind of you know, I don't know a lot of his songs. Like it's just solo as a solo artist. But is, is it a Harry he, Styles song? Well, he was part of that band. <gasps> You're insecure. Don't know what for. Do you know what song I'm singing? Something about being beautiful. Yes. What makes you beautiful from one That's direction?、It. And of course, Harry Styles was a big star in that big group, One Direction, along、mm-hmm. with Lewis and Zayn <laughs> and Liam and、huh? the other guy. <laughs> and of course, now Harry Styles has broken out of that boy band. He's on his own. He's got a great solo career.、Exactly. I believe he just released what a second, maybe third album. Really? I don't know. Yeah, he's he's probably been a solo singer. For almost as long as he was in One Direction, because、mm. it was a few years ago, and he's just as popular, or even、oh, more popular. Way more popular,、wow. and of course, he's also branched out now. He's in fashion, he's in movies, exactly. He's kind of everywhere. He's like a superstar now, and he looks great in pearls. Ooh,、mm. really? Yeah, he does.、Yeah. Okay.、Yeah. Well, I can't wait to learn more about Harry Styles. <laughs> <Yeah> . <laughs> Though still only in his twenties, British singer Harry Styles has a long list of number one hits and music awards to his name. He sold over 70 million records as a member of the band One Direction before going on to top the charts again and again as a solo artist. But where and how did this young star's rapid rise to the top begin? So today we are looking at part one of Pop's Prince Harry, Harry Styles. Oh, I'm、right? so exciting! <laughs> That's right. It seems kind of he's been around for a really long time. I mean, he、exactly. was famous for quite a few years in One Direction, as、mm-hmm. we said. He's been a solo singer now for a few years. So, as we begin our article, it's kind of a, a little bit of a surprise. It says, "Though still only in his twenties." <gasps> really? British singer Harry Styles、wow. has a long list of number one hits and music awards to his name. Yeah. So we're beginning that by kind of reminding us that he is still quite a young man, right?、Mm-hmm. He's still only in his twenties. He's been famous for what, close to ten years now. But he's done a lot in that time. He's had lots of hit records, and of course, he's also won some awards for his music. Exactly, and an award is a noun. Award is the prize or a reward that you get for something. For something that maybe you've done great in, maybe you're a really good writer, you could get an award in writing as、sure. as well. Or maybe if you're a really good actor, you could get an award for acting. So, for example, the artist. Won an award for his album cover design. So if you're very good at the album cover design, you can also get an award. Interesting. And of course, these awards can come in different shapes, right? You might get a statue, like an Oscar. You、mm-hmm. might get a medal you wear around your neck. A piece of paper you can put on your wall that looks very nice and official. But yeah, if you've done something really great, if you've won a prize, this would be an award of some kind. So he's won awards for music. He does other things. So maybe he's won other awards too. But really. It's the music that he's been most successful with, and just how successful has he been with the music? Well, let's learn more.、Mm. He sold over 70 million records as a member of the band One Direction. That's amazing. That's right. Before going on to top the charts again and again as a solo artist. So we're talking about being a solo artist.、Mm. Before he was in a boy band, right?、Mm-hmm. So it's like a group of boys, and they're. Starting a band, singing together, they have different songs. But now he's a solo artist. That means he sings by himself, right? <laughs> But where and how did this young star's rapid rise to the top 
begin? We really don't know. That's a very, very good question, and that's going to lead us into some of his history. We're going to go back in time and find out how it all began for Harry Styles. But first, we do have this word chart. When we、mm -hmm. talk about a chart, this is of course a noun. It's basically a large piece of Information that will be shown to you. You don't have to read the information on a chart. They'll draw it in some kind of way to explain that information easily. When we talk about music charts, though, we're basically talking about the list of the most popular songs and albums and things like that. The music that people are listening to right now. If you're number one on the chart or in the charts, we might also say that means basically you have the most popular song in the country.、Mm -hmm. And all pop singers want to be in. In the charts, go to number one, be in the top ten, that type of thing, because it obviously means that people like your music and they're buying a lot of it, which is why your song is going to the top of the charts. Hopefully, just, just like Harry Styles, right? That's, That's why、exactly、he、right. topped the chart, right? When、That's、he topped、right. the chart, that means he's at the top of the chart. Maybe he's number he's one. Number one, yeah, definitely、oh, wow. one so, of the most popular songs around. We have this example sentence. Uncle Homer's song went to the top of the country music charts.、Mm. So country music is another、mm. genre of music, right? That's right. They might have the dance charts, the pop charts, the urban hip hop charts, country music. Things like that, because of course there are popular songs in many styles, but Harry Styles would definitely be in the pop charts. Exactly. How about you, Mike? What kind of music do you enjoy?、Oh. Do you like country music, pop music,、sure. hip hop? All kinds. I like any kind of music as long as it's good. Don't give me your、really? bad, boring music. I like the good music. But no, really, I have a huge variety of tastes depending、mm. on how I feel and things like that. So you know,、uh, once in a while, a Harry Styles song really hits the mark, really fits the bill for me. We're gonna take a break, and then we'll be back with more about Harry, especially his early days. So come back and join us for that. See you soon. Hello, 大家好，我是 Kenny。这次要介绍的人物是知名英国歌手 Harry Styles。他年纪轻轻就已经拥有一长串热门冠军歌曲和音乐奖项。那作为 One Direction 一世代的这个团员呢，他就卖了超过七千万张的唱片，接着又以单飞歌手的身份，一次又一次登上排行榜榜首。好，我们来看单字 Award。Award 就表示奖或是奖项。那么 chart chart 它本来可以指这个图表或是示意图。那在文中呢，它就是指排行榜上唱片销量的排行榜。那 Karen 老师他在讲到音乐类型的时候，他用到 genre 这个字 ，G E N R E。genre 表示类型、题材。那常常用来指向音乐啊、文学、电影、绘画等等艺术作品的类型。好 ，Mike 老师则聊到说，只要是好音乐啊，他都爱。像 Harry Styles 的歌，有时候也会是他正好想要听的音乐。那老师用到两个片语，一个是 fit the bill， 那就表示是符合要求、适合需要；还有用到 hit the mark， 那它可以用来描述某事物它是正中目标、是正确的、适当的或是成功的。那这边两个重点，我们进入文法时间。好，我们来看第一个重点是 to one's name 是指属于某人，常常会用 have something to one's name 来指某人拥有某物，那多半是用来强调某个人他有非常少或非常多的某样物品，像 the writer has several best sellers to his name， 那位作家拥有好几本的畅销书。再看到 go on 的不同用法。第一种，你可以用 go on 去接不定词 to be， 是指说接着去做跟之前不同的事情。像 she introduced herself and went on to show us around the office。她先自我介绍，接着带我们去四处参观办公室。再来 go on 接动词 ing 的时候，则是指继续、持续做，做之前正在做的事。像 he took a sip of his coffee and went on reading the newspaper。他喝一口咖啡，然后继续读报纸。那这节课文中。Born in 1994 in England, Styles was interested in music from a young age, and his gift for music was encouraged by his family. His first ever recording was done with a karaoke machine that his grandfather had given him. At age 16, following advice from his mother, Styles tried out for the popular British TV talent show The X Factor. Originally, he had entered as a solo singer, 
but after failing to progress, he was moved into the groups category with four other young male hopefuls. Although they didn't win, the group named One Direction quickly signed a record deal and began selling songs and albums by the millions. Styles, with his clear musical talent and charming personality, soon became a fan favorite. Welcome back, everyone. So we're still learning about Harry Styles, the famous and talented musician and actor superstar. That's right. Now let's get in our time machine and go back a little bit to find out exactly when the whole Harry Styles story began. And to find out, we have to go back to 1994.、Mm. It says, born in 1994 in England, Styles was interested in music from a young age. And his gift for music was encouraged by his family. Oh, that's very interesting. So he's a child of the '90s, born in 1994 in England. Of course, we could say he was born in Britain or the UK. It's all kind of the same place. And like a lot of people, he loved music when he was young. And maybe a little bit different from some people, his family actually encouraged him and his gift and love for music. If you encourage someone, you're like, "Yeah, you can do it. If you want to sing, you can sing, and I'm sure you're going to be great." So that's nice. So he's very lucky because、yeah. I know that some people are really interested in、right. music, but maybe their families wouldn't really encourage them, right? Exactly. That's、mm. right. Now most people, I would expect, they would maybe sing in the in the local church choir or buy a guitar. Guitar and teach themselves some songs, but this was the 1990s, so、mm -hmm. he had some interesting technology to help him when he was just a baby singer. Exactly, <laughs> his first ever recording was done with a karaoke machine that his grandfather had given him. Aw, that is amazing! Kind of cute.、Too. It is <laughs> with the karaoke machine. We know that a lot of people like to go karaoke in Taiwan,、yeah. so you can go to that little karaoke bar, and then you have the microphone, and then you can read the words, read the lyrics, and sing together. Right? There you go. Absolutely.、Mm -hmm. And of course, since his grandfather gave it to him, probably as a Christmas or a birthday gift. That's a good example of how his family encouraged him. It's also kind of unusual because in England people don't have karaoke machines as much as they do here in Asia, right? right. Yeah,、mm -hmm. so it's, it's really popular it's in kind Asia. Kind of extra special for his family in England、mm -hmm. to go buy this kid a karaoke machine because they knew he would love it, and he did.、Mm -hmm. And it really obviously helped him become a better singer.、And、then we read at age 16, so a few years later. Following advice from his mother, Styles tried out for the popular British TV talent show, The X Factor. Okay,、Ooh. The X Factor, American Idol. You know, there have been a lot of these sort of singing contest shows for young people who want to maybe make it in the business. They get discovered on television. And this was advice given to him by his family. Exactly, and advice is a noun. So basically, advice just means means getting someone's opinion on something. Maybe you have a problem, you're troubled by something, and then you want to ask someone, say, "Hey, what do you think I should do?"、Mm. And that person would give you an advice on that. So, for example. I need advice about starting a business. So maybe I know nothing about starting a business,、mm -hmm. and I will probably go to Mike and I would say, "I need advice about starting a business. Can you tell me what I can do?、Mm. And would you be able to tell me any good advice?" No. <laughs> <laughs> Don't open a karaoke machine business. Okay, that's a good advice. That might be good advice. It's kind of like a suggestion. It's、mm -hmm. my best idea to help this person solve their problem. That's、mm -hmm. basically what I'm doing. And in this case, well, they gave him advice. This advice was to go out and try out for one of these TV talent shows. Like X Factor, talent is basically a kind of natural skill that you're born with. Just the way you were born, the way your brain's made up, means you're just really good at something that other people might have to learn more about and practice harder to get to the same level as you. If you're born with talent and you practice a lot、mm -hmm. and get skill in that way, skill is what you learn. Talent is kind of what you have when you're born. If you can take both of those, well, then you can be one of the best. In the world,、mm -hmm. but if you just find something is naturally easy for you, and other people might go. 
how do you do that? I can't, I tried to so long to learn that and you can just do it. Well, I guess you have some kind of special talent mm -hmm. and we all do, right? That's you right. You just have to discover what yours is. Here's Margot's talent. It says, I think Margot has a lot of musical talent. Mm -hmm. Let's buy her a karaoke machine. <laughs> that's right. That's Obviously, a good that's suggestion. that's the way to go. And you also have musical talent as well, I, right? I, yeah, I like music, you know. <laughs> you know but I You're should, very humble. I should practice more, then my skill might be higher too. But <laughs> All yes. right. Okay, so back to the article. <laughs> mm. Originally, he had entered as a solo singer. So like we said before, solo means by yourself. Mm. So he wasn't signed up for like, you know, to be in a band right. from the beginning. He was just Harry Styles. Exactly. Oh. But after failing to progress, so he failed. He didn't really, you know, succeed. Interesting. So he was moved into the groups category with four other young male hopefuls. And hmm. we all know that's One Direction, right? Yeah, that's kind of cool. I thought like, like a group, they would have gone to school and been friends together and went to the show as a group. But no, mm -hmm. that's not kind of how it worked out. I wonder who the person who put those five guys together was. That's the person who really had a bit of talent. It says, That's although true. they, this is the group he was now in, mm -hmm. although they didn't win, the group named One Direction quickly signed a record deal and began selling songs and albums by the millions. Absolutely, yes, that's, that's very true. That's kind of interesting because most people might start in a group mm -hmm. and then become a solo singer. He kind of did it the other way around. He was a solo singer and then he was in a group. And yes, that group that's did right. pretty well. One Direction, they had a few popular songs. Mm -hmm. I think, you know, you might have heard of them. That's right, they Maybe. were actually really popular. Very But popular. Styles, with his clear musical talent and charming personality, soon became a fan favorite. So I think he was actually really, really popular also because of his personality, you mm -hmm. know, the way he presents himself. And the people really just loved him because he was so charming. Yeah, absolutely. And he also has an unusual name. Mm. I think that helped him too. Harry Styles is That's kind of a, right. a cool name like for a, a pop stage star. Name, right? yeah. Yeah, it is, absolutely. But yeah, so clearly he was very charming. You can see this in the performances, in the videos, when he's doing interviews. If someone's charming, they just have a nice personality that kind of attracts people. They're friendly, they're open, they always want to talk, make you laugh, that kind of thing. They're not kind of grumpy or in a bad mood. No, they're always happy to see you, happy to welcome people. And there's just something about that person that draws other people in. Actresses, actors can be charming. Politicians can be charming. They right. make you want to vote for them and believe in their ideas and things like that. So it's kind of an inside thing. It's not about being good looking or something. It's about being very nice inside, being very interesting and attracting people in that kind of way. For example, my friend took me to a charming restaurant for our lunch date. Now when we talk about a place as being charming, it's cute, it's attractive, it makes you feel welcome, kind of like a person. Mm-hmm, exactly. All right, guys. Well, we learned quite a lot about Harry Styles today and we'll True. be learning more in part two. We will, yes, mm -hmm. but some of the things he's been doing more recently and some of the other things outside of music that you might also want to keep your eye on because this guy's got talent mm -hmm. kind of coming out of his ears so there's always <laughs> something interesting so we hope you can come back and join us for that and we'll see you guys next time bye bye, bye. Harry Styles 从小对音乐感兴趣，那也受到家人的鼓励。像他第一次录音，甚至是用爷爷送他的卡拉 OK 机完成的。那 Mike 老师聊到说，嗯，在他印象中，有些对那种音乐有兴趣的人，可能是会参加当地教堂的唱诗班啊，或者是可能自己买吉他来练习，会用这种卡拉 OK 机，真的是蛮特别的哦。那老师这时候有说到 choir C H O I R choir， 它可以指唱诗班、教堂的唱诗班，或者是和合唱团，好，那么 Harry Styles 在十六岁的时候，他在妈妈的建议下参加了热门的英国电视选秀节目的征选。那么最初，他用个人歌手的身份参加
，他没有办法晋级。那么后来呢，就跟其他四位有望成为明日之星的年轻男子，他们一起被移到团体组。虽然呢，他们没有获胜，但是这个名为 One Direction 一世代的团体很快就签下唱片合约，歌曲专辑大卖。那 Harry Styles 他凭着他音乐天赋和迷人的个性，很快就成为歌迷的最爱了。好，单字 advice， 它表示建议、忠告，那它是不可数名词。那么 talent 在这边当名词表示天赋、天资 ，charming 则是形容迷人的、富有魅力的。Mike 老师则提到说，那种脾气差的人啊是不迷人的。他用到 grumpy, G R U M P Y. Grumpy 表示脾气坏的，容易生气的。那这边一个重点，我们进入文法时间。好，我们来学 try out， 它是指参加，可能是参加竞赛啊、运动什么的甄选，或者是选拔，或者是试镜的意思。那么后面呢，可以接 for 加名词去表达你所要争取的资格或是角色。像 Are you going to try out for the school basketball team? 你要参加篮球校队的选拔吗？好，那以上是今天的讲解，同学别走开，马上回来哦。Though still only in his twenties, British singer Harry Styles has a long list of number one hits and music awards to his name. He sold over 70 million records as a member of the band One Direction before going on to top the charts again and again as a solo artist. But where and how did this young star's rapid rise to the top begin? Born in 1994 in England, Styles was interested in music from a young age, and his gift for music was encouraged by his family. His first ever recording was done with a karaoke machine that his grandfather had given him. At age 16, following advice from his mother, Styles tried out for the popular British TV talent show The X Factor. Originally, he had entered as a solo singer, but after failing to progress, he was moved into the groups category with four other young male hopefuls. Although they didn't win, the group named One Direction quickly signed a record deal and began selling songs and albums by the millions. Styles, with his clear musical talent and charming personality, soon became a fan favorite. I'm Josh, and today we're playing a game called Guess the Bear, where we each have three cards with words or phrases on them. But instead of saying the word or phrase, we're going to say the word bear, and so we're going to have to guess what the word or phrase is. So, are you ready? I'm so ready. All right. Let's. So you can start first, and let's go now. All right. One word noun. I always go to my older sister for bear, and if you want my bear, be careful in this situation. Uh, recommendation. Similar. Adv uh, advice. Yes, advice, good. Advice. Yes, 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 good. All right. One word noun. Her first single went to the num went to number one on the Bears, and the pop music Bear lists the top 100 songs of the week. I reckon that's gotta be charts. Yes. Oh yeah. Very two, good. Two. Phrase three words. Her family encouraged her to bear, bear, bear the talent show. And I bared bear bear the soccer team last year as a goalie.、Uh, do not go.、Uh, not quite. Her family encouraged her to bear 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 the talent show. And I bared bear bear the soccer team last year as a goalie.、Uh, acted as a. Ah,、uh, almost. <laughs> not quite. It's try out for. So. Her family encouraged her to try out for the talent show, and I tried out for the the soccer team last year as a goalie. Damn,、so, yeah. it's feel, okay. I feel so ashamed. It's okay. <laughs> the phrase, three word phrase. <laughs>、okay. It's pretty hard. Are you ready now? <laughs>、oh, yes, All right, it's your turn. Let's do it. Let's do it.、Okay. Start the timer now.、Okay. Noun, one word. He's won many bears for his music and acting. A new artist got the bear for album of the year.、Uh, award. Oh yeah. We're off to a good start, flying start. Now we have another one, another noun, another one word. She can sing, act, and dance. She's got bear. My brother showed an early bear for drawing. Okay, could it possibly be talent? I think it definitely is talent. Okay, good. I think you've got a talent for these bear games. <laughs> Thank you. You practice. <laughs> Phrase: Two words. After graduating, he bared bear 
to become a doctor. I want to keep climbing the mountain, but I can't bear bear. Oh, oh wait, I was going to say study hard. Um, keep going? Wait. Uh, or you... Right direction, right direction. Uh, can you say it again? Sure. After graduating, he bared bear to become a doctor. I want to keep climbing the mountain, but I can't bear Work bear. Work hard. No. Oh. <laughs> I'm afraid it wasn't. The phrase was go on. Oh, go on. So oh, phrase yeah. two words, after graduating, he went on to become a doctor. I want to keep climbing the mountain because I can't go on. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Next time. Oh, well, we're even. See you next time!